Is the world at its breaking point? The United Nations thinks so. Welcome to The Breaking Point on the Next News Network. You know, it seems the United Nations wants you dead. Their solution to global warming. That's, of course, according to Christiana Figueres, the Executive Secretary of the United Nations Framework Convention on Climate Change. That's right, at the recent Climate One conference, she spoke to the organization's founder, Greg Dalton, and revealed the agenda right out in the open. Ladies and gentlemen, it is no longer a secret. Roll tape. A related issue is uh, fertility rates and population. A lot of people in energy and environmental circles don't want to go near that because uh, it's politically charged, it's not their issue. But isn't it true that stopping the rise in population would be one of the biggest levers in driving the rise in greenhouse gases? Is that well, I, I mean, we all know we expect 9 billion, right, by, by 2050. Um, so, yes, obviously less people would exert less um, pressure on the natural resources. And, um, and, and that's it's So is just 9 math. billion a foregone conclusion that's like baked in, done, not gonna, no way to change that? Well, there again, there's pressure in the system um, to go toward that. We, we can definitely change those, right? We can definitely change those numbers. Um, and we really should make every effort to change the numbers because we are already today, already exceeding the planetary car carrying capacity. Today. Make every effort, their own words, the planet has already exceeded its human carrying capacity. Too many people breathing, to them, means too much greenhouse gas emissions. So, what's their solution going to be? Well, I know that you are aware of something called the Earth Hour, where everyone shuts off electricity for one hour each year at the same exact time. I'm willing to bet the next UN campaign is going to be everyone hold their breath for an hour or two. Now, I wouldn't be surprised, but for me, I won't hold my breath. What's your breaking point? Has the UN gone too far? I can't wait to read your comments below. For the Next News Network, I'm Gary Franchi.